What's up y'all, it's Darren Meyer with ADS Sprinters and behind me we have one of our newest 4x4 adventure vans. This is a 144 2021 4x4 van with a full custom conversion on the inside, built to travel and sleep four people comfortably. Super excited to show this one off, so let's go take a look. All right, so going around some of the exterior features of this van, we have our signature aluminum sidestep. Uh, this is a super heavy duty running board that we built in house. Great for a nice solid step to get up into the van. It's also really good for keeping shopping carts or brush or anything off the side of the vehicle. So rather than hitting the body, you know, anything in the, in the grocery store parking lot is going to hit this sidestep instead. So. Looks great, it's functional, um, and it also offers some good protection for the outside of the van. We have our own in-house fabricated aluminum roof rack, as well as a Fiamma powered awning. And then moving back, we have some Alvans racks on the back door here. We have a B2 with, this is gonna have one up bike trays on here, and then a large size storage box in the back of the van. So a little bit of extra storage for all the gear that a family of four is gonna bring along with them at all times. The roof rack is just as custom as the rest of the van. It's got a full expanded metal floor so you can stand up on there, load gear wherever you need to. And we have 180 watts of solar integrated into the roof rack, straddling that vent fan. All right, so looking outside the van, uh, but still some notable features of the interior build, which really help us outside the vehicle. So we have one, a massive flip down table. So this thing's gigantic. Uh, we have space for a cooktop, we have space to set up a small bar, have a, you know, a wine set up here, a charcuterie board, whatever you want to. There's a huge amount of space on this flip down table. Below that we have kind of a nice kind of access panel which is easy to get to. So that could be a, a tool roll, that can be flip flops, that can be dog leashes. We have a forward facing refrigerator. This is convenient because it opens all the way around and I can load this from standing outside of the vehicle. Uh, so that's a really convenient feature for a nice tight interior where I can get all my food in and out without having to get bags up in there every single time I want to load something in the fridge. So convenient uh, for grabbing a drink or a beverage or a snack while you're out camping, but also loading it up from the grocery store. At the front side of the cabinet, I have a flip down door with lots of storage space below for an induction cooktop. And I also have a pull out slide for utensils or uh, whatever cooking gear you might need. Easy access to from inside or from outside the vehicle. At the front of the van, we have comfortable seating for four. We have factory front stool bases, so when I need to have like a, you know, share a comfortable meal without using the back dinette, I can stool those front two chairs around, have more of a communal area up front. Moving back, I have a big open countertop space for food prep or I can put an induction cooktop here. We have a pop-up outlet uh, built into the countertop, so that's nice for quick, easy power for a blender or your cooktop or whatever you need to uh, while you're using this as a kitchen space. Here we have a Torva 18 by 18 zero radius sink. Uh, so this is a really nice unit because it's a little bit bigger than the new body, um, just big enough to where I'm not gonna have any spillage from the sink um, and have a little more space to wash dishes and kind of use uh, things going on inside the sink. In the back, uh, we have our signature dinette. So this is sideways facing seating. So this one has seat belts for six more people. Um, so I can travel up to 10 people in this van total. So I have six seat belts, three on each side. The backrest here will pull out and fill the center to make a bed down low. And then I have an additional bed on a Euro loft up top. So I can drop this bed down and I have little wings that are built onto the side here. So I can fold out these side wings and then take an additional cushion which is stored below fill in that gap and I have bed space for four people. Two up here, two down low. Uh, the idea here is to sleep side to side. So I have about 70 inches by about 60 inches on here. And then we also have our telescoping bathroom system right behind me. So this is nice because this is a full bathroom. It's all, you know, it, it expands out to have a shower, a full toilet, everything you need, but it's compacted against the wall. So I can still stand up here. I can spin easily. These are magnetic doors. So pull through the magnets. This door will open up and you'll notice I have a curtain on the inside here. So I have a curtain with a zipper that magnets on the inside of the wall and I have an additional tray that pulls out, fills the middle here that makes my shower tray. At the back of the van, we also have an additional uh, exterior shower mount. So this is a quick release system. So you can get this head out of the way. You don't have to have this hose clanking around as you drive. I have a, a hookup at the back underneath the dinette here. If you are taking the shower, we have a convenient mount right here for the shower head. And we also have our curtain, which pulls across and clips on from door to door to make a, a nice private shower area. 